Welcome to my channel, I'm Ars Drake, and today I will talk to you about the options how you can check up the game Star Citizen or how you start with the game Star Citizen. And why I'm doing it? Because there are some positive voices and negative voices about the development of the game. And now, if you are interested, it can be hard to decide how you would start with the game or um, what can you do? And this is the point of this video. First of all, to the people who are interested into the game. Uh, Star Citizen is a game in development, it's in the alpha phase of Cloud Imperium, CIG. And there's a website is called Robot Space Industries. And on the website you have the option to make for free an account. At the best with a referral code. I show you my code and if you are interested down below is a link where you can uh, get directly on the registration with the referral code. And that's it. If you are interested this is the best option for you to uh, uh, watch into the game. Why I'm saying it? Because Cloud Imperium CAG gives you an option what you will not find at any other publisher. You can test the game in the development, especially uh, uh, on a minimal base of two times in the year. In May is an Invictus week, in, in November an Aerospace Expo. These two uh, weeks are the option to test the game for free. You only need this account. Then you can download the game and Test everything without a paywall. Also, you don't have to pre-order the game or to buy the game. And then, if you are decided uh, um, to uh, start with the game and you are interested to buy it, then we are coming to this point. You are going uh, into the pledge store and come on this page. This is a main page of the store, and you will see it's uh, similar like a page of every other publisher. Here are some, um, uh, uh, um, how you say it, uh, uh, offerings uh, to you. You are finding two game packages what are offered, some standalone ships, the merchandise, everything what you will find also on a regular store. And now you will start with the game. Then you must go here on the game packages. And you will see this page. I have ordered it besides the prizes, that's why I'm prepared this aside. And you are interested in to start the game. You need one of these two game packages. The Mustang Alpha starter game package or Aurora MR starter package. Nothing more is needed to play Star Citizen. Everything else is an optional buy to make it you a little bit easier or you are interested to support the project a little bit more. So, if you are buying one of these two game packages, you can play the full content of Star Citizen without uh, to be uh, expect, uh, expecting a paywall in the game where you must pay additional. This is a point what I'm interested to point out. Now, um, why I'm uh, it's saying it in this way? Because there are some negative voices who are uh, not saying it directly, they are only mentioning it, that you have to pay every ship for real money. And especially there was a video of a German YouTube channel um, for games, Game 2 it calls, who had made a video about it where they are pointing, uh, pointing it in this direction. They are not mentioning that you have other options. I have my own video about their videos. You find above under info, my, my video if you are interested. And also I'm showing in, in the video the store in-game where you can buy the ships for in-game currency. And that is the point where I'm saying that everything else on this site is an optional purchase. 
you want to start with Star Citizen, the minimum investment, Mustang Alpha or the Aurora MR starter package. And everything is an uh, other point. If you are saying that the Aurora, uh, Aurora MR or the Mustang Alpha have not enough options for you or are not good enough in the um, start point is a lot a slow pacing you can say okay i want to invest a little bit more like uh, like saying in the avenger titan starter package then uh, you have not to buy additional this game package you can exchange your existing game package you are getting store credits without the value added tax and take the store credits to buy the Avenger Titan and on the difference between the prices of the store credits and the end price here on this difference you are paying the value added tax again and all you are saying I'm interesting to upgrade my Mustang to the Avenger Titan or the Aurora MR both ships have the same value you can go here above on the ship upgrades, come to this uh, additional web uh, um, part of the website. You are here, so let me say that you have the Aurora MR and you are going down to the Avenger Titan. What have a, a ship value of $55 and the Aurora MR have $30 uh, value and pay the difference between the uh, ships. I know the difference is $25, but value added taxes, I have had to pay in this uh, um, example 20, uh, 29 euros and 16 cents. And that, that's it. Why am I pointing it this way out? Like I said, there are some negative voices who are calling out you that you have to buy every ship for real money. And this is how I am saying I have a video where I am showing this in-game store. Not the point. Let me show you an example where also this argumentation that uh, they get a limited sailing of sh uh, ships what to, uh, uh, are to uh, grab your cash. We are seeing here three ships, the Hammerhead, the Saber Raven and the Eclipse. And yes, if I'm going now under the standalone ship web page, this, this, this site, I'm seeing every sea, uh, ship what is about the uh, um, whole year for, uh, for purchase. And I will not find the Hammerhead, I'm not finding the Eclipse what would be in this uh, price range. And I will never see the Saber Raven. I'm mentioning the Saber Raven because she is a really physical limited ship on a sale. This was in a year of the Citizen Con where you could purchase this ship only on this time period because CIG had a cooperation with Intel who had sold their M2 SSD. On, uh, on the Citizen Con with the Saber Raven as an exclusive ship. Today you can only buy the ship uh, across the grey market or on eBay. But this had nothing to do with CIG and so this is a real limited ship. The Hammerhead and the Eclipse you can purchase, uh, purchase, in, uh, purchase in game for the uh, whole year, not only on the two events of the years. And that is my point. You don't have to buy every ship for real money. You don't have to buy additional ships for real money. You can. And this is an op uh, option because Star Citizen is a crowdfunded game. And some negative voices are not mentioning it. This is a point. Because there are not telling you that crowdfunding means it is uh, uh, it has nothing to do only with CIG. If you think at, uh, on Kickstarter, you are on the uh, they are the same function of kick, uh, crowdfunding, and this is the point. If I'm a, uh, in investing into the project more money, then I will always get something back uh, uh, back for it. The game standalone costs me. 
in this uh, 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 time 52 uh, euros and 48 uh, cents and nothing more if i'm investing more in uh, in the game i'm buying a bigger game package or i'm buying additional ship i'm getting the ship back uh, for it for my purchase for my uh, 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 pledge on the store and this is the point where i'm saying the difference between this publisher and, and other publisher and again if you are only interested into the game to play it to uh, uh, test it first of all to test it don't buy it use the free flight events if you are interested buy the smallest game packets what you are needed especially in the time of the Invictus week and the Aerospace Expo, you find um, price reducing on almost two or three game packages. There are, until now, I think almost every time, one of these two. I don't know, um, most of the time it's the Aurora MR or the uh, Mustang Alpha, who gets, uh, I think, a 10% uh, percent price reduction. And in the uh, last Invictus week, it was the uh, Anvil um, C, uh, C8X Pisces, um, where you can also use this time of the year to get a package for price reduction. And nothing more of your money must be invested in this project if you don't like it, don't want it. Or anything else you will not find the price wall uh, in the um, in the game where you must pay, pay additional uh, something every other ship can be purchased in-game for in-game money in-game currency if you are interested in the ships and I hope this was good enough to uh, for understanding if yes, give me a like, a subscribe to my YouTube channel, or you are interested to watch me. I'm streaming every day between 9 and a half to 12 o'clock in the morning after German time. And I hope to see you the next time on my channel. Until then, I'm your Strike.